Good morning, this is Jill Cornelius, creative partner number 247096. I should say Kiwi Lane creative partner 247096. That number is important when it comes to orders. If you order through me, please use my number. I would greatly appreciate it. Um, like I said, I am coming from Mazatlan today. My husband decided that we were going away and this is where he wanted to go. So I packed up my box with my photo mount and I stuck it in my suitcase and then I got a delivery. I got my Kiwi Lane kit and this is for February 2022. I was a little sad that I didn't get this before I left town. However, a fellow scrapbooker reached out to me and she, she follows my videos and she asked me if I would like her to send me her kit. She said she could wait for hers to get there when I come back. So we're exchanging kits this month and I really, really think that's very sweet of somebody to do for me. So with the help of a fellow scrapbooker, let's look at the February Kiwi Club kit. I have taken it out of the box because I'm in Mexico and I don't want anybody to know where. I mean, well, you know I'm in Mazalon, but Never can be too careful down here. It's not bad, really. I feel perfectly safe walking the streets. Every month, Kiwi Club recipients receive this kit, and on the cover sheet, is now just a half sheet, it shows you the templates that you receive, as well as the suggested templates to use along with this. This month, the template set is called Grow, and there's seven templates there. We'll show you those shortly. And then the recommended sets to use with this are the Tiny Plants Tiny Accessory, as well as the Tiny Springtime Tiny Accessory. As you notice, there is a QR code here. If you shoot that QR code with your camera, it'll bring you to the website where you can shop or download a free digital idea book that's made by the Kiwi Lane creators for this specific kit. Also on the website, there are a lot more kits, well, idea books for the kits that you can download, you can print them out, and you can have your own Kiwi Lane Kiwi Club design book. So let's look at the papers for this month. I will tell you which is my favorites. I'll show you side A and B. And then I'll show you the cards and the templates. So this is the first, I should turn, let me see if I can get some more light in here. Since I said I'm away from home, I'm not, not too good with light and stuff in this timeshare that we have. It's not a timeshare, it's actually an Airbnb. So let's see if that helps a little bit. Um, we'll work with it. So this is side A, it's a light pink, has like a scallop design in the paper. This is side B, it's a blue, and it has like a zigzag design in it. I like side A. There's also two of these, so you don't have to use just one. You can use one of side A and then one of side B if you choose. There are also two of this, it's a taupe and Know what that is a taupe and it also has a zig side zigzag tongue twister design just like the blue and then there's a side b i like both of them this is the next sheet and i believe yes there are two of these also so you have two green and it's like a little like a plus sign you know I don't know what you want to call it it's a plus sign so you have this this side a and then side B is a light blue with the scallop design just like the pink one previously okay this is a very pretty floral print very pretty has the leaves that are similar to a template in the tiny plants flowers very cute. I like this side. Let's see side B. 
Side B is a floral design, a light green floral design. It's actually a light green on a little bit of a darker green. It's very pretty, but I like side A. Okay, the next one is this really pretty, it's like a bluish gray. It's a bluish gray with a lighter shade of the same color on top of it. Very pretty. Side B, ooh, I love the plaid too. It's gonna be a hard one to decide which is this one, so we'll just say both. This is a wheelbarrow with flowers inside of it. Very pretty. This is side A. Side B. It's a little pink with a mm, it's sort of like I'm not really sure what that design is, but it doesn't matter. I like side A. This is very pretty. It has a combination of all the colors of paper that are in the set. This is side A. Side B is another taupe on taupe. I like side A. Luckily, I did bring some tools with me on my trip, so maybe I'll get to creating with this. Have to figure something out. Uh, side A, diamond pattern. Side B, stripes. Just a personal preference for me. The paper came in the package like this sideways. I always think that stripes need to go up and down. So that's how I'm showing it is up and down. And the final sheet is this light green on green. It's very pretty, pale green with a darker green. And then garden tools and boots and a greenhouse, little sprouts. I like the green side. So that's all the paper that's in the kit. Okay, let's do the sentiment cards. Please remember that if you don't like the sentiment cards, don't throw them away. Well, you can give them away, but don't throw them away. You can always use them to punch or cut out. You can cut out flowers or pots or a bird or any of these also. So let's look at them. The first one is Naturally Beautiful. You could use this for a little girl page or a teenager page. Side A, side B. Probably gonna stick with side B for that. My daughter's 27. 27? 26. Sorry, Sarah. Everyday Moments, it's a journaling sentiment card. Side B. Growing like a weed. For a little kid's page, growing like a weed. Side A. Side B. Never grow up. Side A. Side B. Again, I'm sorry for the lighting problems in here. It's a little bit harder since I'm not out in the direct sunlight outside where it's really pretty. But there's also noise from the neighbors and everything. Side A, side B. Probably going to use side B. Love grows here. Side A, side B. Lord help me grow has all these different sayings on it. You can use this with a, a stencil like last month. They had a jar, but this will also, I'll show you later. It'll work with one of the stencils in this, in the, one of the templates in this week's or this month's kits. I'll show you in a minute. Remember your roots. Side A. Side B. A garden is a friend you can visit anytime. Side A, side B. Play in the dirt because life is too short to always have clean fingernails. I remember that from when I was a little kid, playing in the mud and everything. Side A, side B. The only time I play in the mud right now is when I work in the garden or out in the front yard. Side B. Side A, to plant a garden is to believe in tomorrow. Side A. Side B. And finally, the last card is plant smiles, grow laughter, and harvest love. Side A. Side B. So those are all of the sentiment cards. Let's look at the stencils. 
as I said earlier, this month's stencil kit is titled Grow. The title of the kit club for this month is Grow a Happy Life. So there's the QR code again for you to scan and it'll bring you to the idea book and the website and everything. In this month's kit, there are seven different templates and let's look at them. They're all numbered now. Kiwi Lane has this great new thing where they number all of the stems, the templates. They put the name on it and it says, like there's seven in here, it's grow number one of a seven. So if you lose one, you just simply send support at Kiwi Lane and email. And if they have an extra, they will sell it to you. I think the cost is around $4. And yes, I have lost templates before, and that's all I do. Number two of grow, it's a sign, or yeah, it's a sign for the little vegetables and flowers and stuff. Number three is a flower. This flower matches some of the flowers in the paper. There's that one. Number three is seven. Number four of seven is a planter. Or you can make it a cauldron, even though Kiwi does have a cauldron template that I purchased. It was one of the very first a la carte that came out. I have an idea on that one. I need to work on it. I'll share it with you when I have it done. This problem is you have all these ideas and you don't have time to do them. Uh, number five of Grow is a sun hat. And I do not have a ruler with me. But this is 12 inches, so you can see it's about three, six, three inches wide. Number six, this probably is my most favorite template of this set. It's a little snail. Isn't it cute? I love the swirl. You can use a stipple brush or, brush or ink or pen or whatever. You could doodle it. Very cute. It's my favorite one out of the set. And then we have the wheelbarrow. I have a gem on me. Hmm. Must have come in my suitcase. <laughs> uh, number 77 is the wheelbarrow that you can put flowers in. You can have flowers sticking up. Or you could use those lines and journal on them. So that's the set for this month of Grow a Happy Life. Now, I did say earlier that there is a sign in this set, and there are these titles for the pages. As you can tell, they fit right on top of there. See that? Fits right there. All of them fit this sign. And that's the great thing about this kit. And most of the kits, well, all of the kits, when they have these sentiments printed out in a certain swerve or area or size, it usually means that they fit a template in that kit. So, that is this month's Kiwi Lane Kiwi Club Kit, Grow a Happy Life. I will have my website link down below, as well as a link to my Facebook group if you would like to come and join me. There I share all of my ideas, my scrapbook pages, and everything else I can share, as well as new products. Thank you for coming by to watch today. Have a great day. And I'll see you when I come back to Texas. Thanks. Bye.